So what type of response do you get from the drivers? <laughs> we get waves, we get horn honking, we get victory signs, and a lot of birds, uh -oh. but they're not eagles. <laughs> so people may not, people may be misunderstood thinking that uh, that uh, government health care is going to be free. Do you think that's what they're... Yep, we have to pay for it and we won't even get good care. It's really free. So when the government tells you they're going to give you free medical care, watch out. It's not free. What you'll end up with is rationing. There is no way you can give anyone a commodity free. Should we give everyone free groceries? It's not going to happen. Well, you so, know, the Obama administration claims that they're going to get everybody to, to provide health care more efficiently government never does anything more efficiently. Look at how they're doing Medicare right now. What was it about the video about the Indian health care, Wendy? What lesson does that have for us? Well, the government's been running all of Indian health care for more than a century, and it's done very inefficiently. Everything is, things are wasted tremendously, and those on the reservation, they have a saying, um, don't get sick after June 1st. Fiscal years run out. And the uh, the Dick Morris video that uh, what what is that? What's his opinion? What does he lessons does he or warnings does he have? Well, he wants everybody to know that once you get medicine socialized, you get the government control over it. You are never going to be able to get government out of it because it takes so long to train a doctor or a nurse. It takes so long to get specialized equipment, everything in place, especially the training of the personnel. That people are not going to go into the field, and when you decimate the field and you don't have the medical personnel, people are not going to want to go to a free market and then wait 16 years. That you can't even get voters to wait four years for another election cycle before they change their minds. So trying to get the government back out of it is going to be next to impossible. Any other message we should take away from this? Keep your freedom. Keep your choice. Don't let the government control your life.